In the last days, during the time in which God incarnate saves man, God does not display any signs and wonders. He does not perform any work that goes beyond the boundaries of practicality or reality. But rather he uses words to provide for people's lives And to expose people and cleanse them of their corruption God's words are life God's words are life And they can provide for the living of corrupted men Mankind, and provide everything corrupted mankind needs for life Provide everything corrupted mankind needs for life In terms of power and authority God's words can change Mankind's living conditions Change their thoughts and views Change their heart that has been deeply corrupted by Satan Furthermore, they can change the path they've chosen And their life direction And even change their outlook on life and values As long as you accept God's words and submit to God's words And it can even be said As long as you love and pursue God's words Then no matter what your caliber is like Or what the goal of your pursuit is or how great your determination to pursue is Or how great your faith is God's words can definitely change you God's words can definitely change you Enable your outlook on life And your values to change Enable your thoughts and your views on people and things to change And ultimately enable your life disposition to change Not only can God's words provide for people's lives And provide them with what they but more importantly, God's words cannot be changed by any force. God's words cannot be changed by any force. Because God's words carry authority And the authority of God's words cannot be transcended By any worldly theory, philosophy, or knowledge Or any argument, thought, or view this is the practical meaning of God's words Carrying authority And this is clearly exhibited In all those who follow God God's words carry authority And can change mankind's hearts and thoughts more importantly they can cleanse
lies and dispel the corrupt dispositions Satan has planted. Deep inside people's innermost hearts, this is the power of God's words. This is the power of God's words.